Hello guys, it's Capacad Warrant, going to be playing Stay Alive, and in today's episode, I'm actually going to give you a tip on the old mansion that you will definitely use a couple of times. Now remember, the old mansion have a countdown on 48 hours, meaning that more than two days, every second day actually, in Cable of Dune, this trick that I'm going to show you guys now, it's going to give you free chest in each and every one of them. You don't need anything. The only thing I have on me right now is my back. I gotta show you guys that. I'm sorry, I'm lying. I have this can right here and this one. Uh, just because I don't want it at my home base. I'm just gonna fill it inside of here. Now, if this is new for you, you need definitely to do this particular thing. This is the area you need to clean out first. Of course, you need weapons for doing that. When you kill all the zombies, don't loot anything from them. And don't loot any of the chests. So meaning that every time there's a stone or something around here, this one I didn't empty. If I empty this one out, I'm actually going to lose all of the ability to fill item inside of it. So that's one of the things in it. So what I want to show you guys is instead of having all of these right here, using those, you are incapable of doing this trick. Now remember one thing, this is not going to stay forever. So when I'm actually saying this, you need to use the benefit right now, go online right this minute and do this kind of thing that I'm doing now. For doing this, you need a chip. The chip is going to open up this little area right here. This one right here is going to be used a chip. So we're gonna take that, turn it on. I'm gonna place the other four ones right here. Now there's a glitch in the game. Sometimes when you're entering this area right here, all the chests are open. And I'm not lying, it's no, I don't do anything, just uh, I'm actually not pausing this and going in and out. But sometimes the main problem is, in my game, is that it stopped recording. So if that's going to happen right now, I'm just going to start it again. If this area is not open up all the chests right now, and I can see it right here. No, it's not open up all the chests right now. So you can see the guys are right here. Nothing had opened up. Then I'm going to show you guys what to do. I normally go talk to this one. And I don't know if this is going to have an impact on it. But I feel it have an impact on it. So now what I'm going to do. Sometimes I go inside of here and go back. But. This time I just go back here. And go in again. And these guys might be gone. I do hope that I can do it in one run. Uh, for less than three days ago, I wanted to make this video for you guys, but it ended up actually stopped recording so that I did empty all the chest and it looked kind of silly uh, for you guys to see empty chest. Now, when you empty all the chest and you go back and forth, the chest will disappear. Remember that. So uh, you're only capable of looting them one time. So we need to go down instead. I'm sorry about that. That's a little irritating. Guys, I do know my recordings are stopping sometimes. So please don't stop this time. Let's just go in here and going back at the same moment. I don't know what, why, and how this glitch is actually activated. If this is the way we're coming back too fast or something, I don't know. Because uh, when I was playing this, if, when they actually came out with it, this kind of glitch didn't actually appear. Okay, now we're just gonna get irritating on this glitch. Uh, keep on going. We will not stop doing this until they open up the sesame code. The code is presto el tempo. Let's do this. Come on, man. So irritating. Please, please, please. Go away. If they're not gonna go away, I'm going back again. They're still here. Damn it. I'm looking at the minimap. Uh, the minimap is revealing if they're at that particular point. Now I'm going to do something else. Okay. And sometimes it will activate by doing this. That's why I have these kind of things here. I'm going to use the 20 uh, dot signs. And why I'm going to use them is because they are the easiest ones to get. And there's funny enough, uh, the one that's going to open up the biggest chest. Now the great thing in by opening just one of them when you're going back and forth, is sometimes that you actually get the full uh, amount of chest opening. I know that sounds stupid, but actually, when you're going back and forth again, they might open. So, they're still here, damn it! Stupid 
stupid, stupid video. I'm actually just... I, I'm seriously about this, I'm not lying, so... You guys might think, copycat, you're a big liar. Okay, now I'm just gonna open it up here. And we're gonna take just a katana with us. Hello. And going in here. And going back again, that's the mean... Main thing, I'm just gonna kill one zombie here. Just to see if that's going to inflict it. Sometimes I do that. Come on. Wanna kill one? Oh, dude, you guys are big. I can feel it. This is stupid thing. Kill two of you. And then I go out. Remember when you're going back and forth and the cops align uh, at that particular level two? When you're going back to level two, they will disappear, those corpses. And, oh my god, I thought they were actually here. Gone, damn it. Let's go out here, just hoping it. Sometimes you need to stop the game. Okay, we can do that. We're going to stop the game and you guys can see whatever I have on my phone right now. Just a second. Uh, just a second. And then we're going to start it again. And hopefully, yeah, we're starting it. Perfect. And we're still recording. That's a good thing. It's normally it's just stopping. And I'm drinking a cup of coffee in the meantime. Come on, upload. This is not cheating. Remember, this is not cheating. We can't say that it's cheating because it's not cheating if it's work, it's a glitch in the game, and we're just using those glitches like a wall trick that I showed you guys. If you haven't seen the wall trick, you're actually capable of killing zombies through the wall. It's pretty funny. It's not like when you're seeing on Last Day on Earth the wall trick where you're going back and forth, back and forth. That's not cheating. It's just using the ability of the game itself. Okay, so let's see. Now we're actually just going down here. Please be gone. That would be so great. So this glitch will work. And we got them all open like that. I love this game. Oh my freaking God. Perfect. Now, just one thing. I open up the first area. I don't think that's... You guys need to do that, right? Sometimes you need to do it. You don't need to uh, delete the game like one of you guys actually said you needed to do. You just need to go in and out. Uh, if I'm going back now up uh, and actually taking out all of these items here uh, there's just one little thing in it all the doors might lock again so that means I'm a little picky here I don't need all that uh, that means that the only three areas that's like uh, sorry the only area that's going to be opened up for me is the area where I actually use my cart so I hope you guys understand what I'm saying this one right here is only getting Open. So I'm going to empty this one and this one and filling up in the other chest at that point so that when I'm going back and forth, it will still be open. But of course, it's quite easy for me to loot almost everything because I have a big, big bag on me. So that's a good thing. Let's see. If you guys are making the RTB itself, ATB, sorry, uh, it's pretty easy now because you will get a lot of items by doing this. Let's just see where... Going to fill in some bullets and this and this and uh, fill in bullets. Come on. And this one. I'm filling up the bullets that I have in my impact. Uh, uh, sorry, my backpack. So let's just see. Oh, this is so crazy. Look at this. What is the best I have? I'm going to take this off. I think that's looking a little better. It's also having 25 in ability. So look at this. This is so freaking crazy. And I can go back and forth checking all the other items. I still don't have any shoes on. There were some shoes and a helmet. But right here, we know that we get the best loot. Look at this craziness of running around. There's also a sniper gun. And if you guys have seen any of my videos, this is what I'm been doing oh my god i need that i can feel it uh let's just sniper gun you are so fun my sniper gun 
God damn it, I should be making... Why am I not making music when I sing that bad? Okay, let's just see. Um, last chest to chest. Love it. That, and of course this one. Oh, it's really slow on getting that. Okay, this one is two, that's okay. Look at this, we want these throw those away. Look at this one I got right here. Six. Oh my god. Okay, perfect. This is what you get, guys. This is not cheating. This is just a glitch. I need to say that a lot of times just to feel that I'm not doing any kind of cheating. I don't want to do cheating in this game. I just want to learn you guys that there's some glitch in it. And yeah, we can't afford cheating because we don't want to get our, our uh, account banded. So, but I uh, hope you guys are actually going to use this little trick. Yeah, I think it's pretty awesome, actually. Uh, I don't know why it is right here at this particular uh, setup. I'm still struggling making uh, day nine, <laughs> getting the last cards. But the great thing is I now have weapons for actually kicking ass. Oh, yeah, there's just a little more I can take before I go out. I will be silly not doing that. So let's just loot the last piece. Because, like I said, there's going to be locked down. This one right here will lock, and this one will lock when I go back in. But this one will be open because I used my... Uh, I, I used the dog tags for actually open that, so... Uh, but it's pretty easy, and it's not killing the gameplay, because there's still a lot of errors opening up that you cannot do this, so... Hope you guys are going to use this. See you guys next time. And Kevin Cat, please subscribe to my chat channel, and give this video a like. Share it for all your friends that are playing it. So make sure your friends are playing Stay Alive, of course. It's actually a pretty awesome game, and I like the developers. They were pretty active in making updates. They have made an update that making it's not available for actually making raids anymore. So if you guys are watching some of the videos where I'm doing raids, it's not available yet. They will do it available again when they find out how the rates are going to be. I can give you guys as a developer a little tip here because I know you guys will watch this video. I normally stream it on your website. Uh, but right now, you guys need to do an update. First of all, make the glitch disappear. Sorry to say it, guys. They need to do that. Another thing, and this is very important, you need to make it active to make rates again. And when you do that, you need to make one more wall and it need to be an iron wall and it should not be breakable. So that means when people are actually upgrading to iron, they have a safe stronghold. So giving them a chance for actually making areas that are not lootable. Another thing is when people are actually destroying a wall, don't let them destroy a, a lot of walls. They shall only be capable of destroying one wall like we do in Last Day on Earth. And how that is, please watch Last End Earth videos that I made. You can definitely see how we're destroying walls there. We're using C4 to actually get in. Uh, if it's a brick wall. So it's it's pretty uh, heavy uh, stronghold that you have. So it's very important to know that a survival game need rates in it. Because that's going to make it giving a little more boost. Hope you guys will also look at a little other thing is actually... Take away day nine, that's too stupid. Finding uh, the full recipe for getting fuel, seriously, that's one thing that suck. But one thing that's for real, and I'm really gonna say that, it is too hard getting it. Cause every time you actually loot a chest, you need to actually enter here, take the chest and open it. And when you open up the chest, you only have a slight chance of getting it. I made a video on that and it's, I have done the run more than 15 times and only got two pieces of my uh, scrap notes here and that's pretty irritating uh, that I need to do that because when I was getting all the other one done I actually didn't get any of these uh, scrap notes so seriously it took me forever just finding out that the scrap notes were inside of the chest so but I hope you guys enjoyed this please subscribe to my channel once again I do need those lights for you guys so see you guys next time bye